Hello. So I'm going to show you guys how to download the MetaTrader 4 platform. I'll go over Wine Bottler real quick, which you need to make sure that you have first. You can just do a search in the search bar for Wine Bottler. If you see mine came up. Um, and then you're going to download Wine Bottler 1.84 development. This is for the latest Mac update. As you can see, it has the Mac OS Sierra um, on here, which is the latest um, update for Mac. Um, you want to go ahead, click on that, and download. It's going to take you to, it says, it tells you how to add. You go to download. It's going to take you to another website where it has the ads. You just wait a little while. Don't respond to that. You see the please wait. And then you're going to click on skip ad. Then, you actually want to click if it doesn't start within five seconds. With mine, as you can see, started. I'm going to close it out because I already have it downloaded. But it started within five seconds. If it doesn't, you want to click on Wine Bottler. And then you'll just proceed like you would with any other Mac app. Now, you want to go to Trader's Way to download the MetaTrader platform. Mine is recently open, but if you go to, let's see, Trader's Way. And MT4. You want to go here. You're going to click on the bottom right. You see download MT4. I should open up and start downloading. You'll see your wine um, application should open and you want to click on convert to simple OS X application bundle with wine bottler. You're going to hit go. So your MetaTrader, your Wine app should automatically um, recognize the app. You want to go to Copy File to App Bundle, and then you're going to click on Include Wine App so that the user doesn't have to install it, and then you're going to click on Install. Here it should pop up for Applications. If not, change it to Applications. You're going to change the name um, to MetaTrader 4 or MT4, however you prefer to call it. I'm going to click call it MT4, and then you're going to hit Save. After this, um, the Wine app and Wine Bottler will do everything else for you. You don't have to do anything else. The application should open up right away. It's going to be creating the MT4 app. Um, you'll see this updating things will pop up. Um, creating the MT4 app. I'm going to go ahead and close out because mine's already downloaded. After this, your app is actually all set. It will automatically pop up. It will automatically pop up and open up for you. Um, MT4 will automatically begin to open. Um,
And then if you don't, so when you're going through the process from the beginning, so you're starting up your computer um, and you want to open it, you don't need to go through Wine. You actually, um, because it's created in your applications, you're going to go to your launch pad. As you can see, MetaTrader 4 here. You're just going to click on it and it will open like normal. Um, so one thing you will notice is that the MetaTrader 4 platform does take a little while to kind of open up every time you open it up, or at least on my computer it does. As you see up here at the top left, you can see MetaTrader 4, so it's trying to open. It's just taking a little while. I'll go ahead and wait and wait for it to open up. Here it goes. Like I said, it, it can take a little while. It could be my Mac because it's kind of old and slow. You're going to hit yes, I agree with all the terms. You're going to go ahead and click next. This will always pop up the um, prompt to download MetaTrader 5. You just close it out. And then this is going to download files and then you just hit finish. It just that um, it takes a, about a couple, of, about a minute or so for it to go through. And here we go. And the program has opened. You'll click Next, and then you'll create your new demo account. Um, I haven't I already have an account, so I'm just going to um, enter my existing account information. Then you hit Finish, and you're all set. Um, let me know if you have any questions. You can um, send me a message in my inbox. Thank you.